Welcome dwellers to my first time of finally playing Poppy Playtime, which yes, I know chapters two and three are already out and also already on console. But frankly, I've just never been able to up until now, thank God. Because I've been wanting to play it for such a long time, but I've never quite been able to. Especially since my computer is has never exactly been a, a good gaming computer. I, but that, that, that does mean it is able to run games. I just have to be careful what kind of games I play. Play. But anyways, with that being said, let's get into this. A tight squeeze. You and, to see. and since we already know what happens, I'm, I'm just gonna like role, role play and pretend as if I'm just a completely different character. gives her answers. She is the first doll actually able to have a conversation with a child. Hard to believe? Just watch. Poppy Playtime! Poppy's as lovable as a real girl, and she talks like one, too. Hi, my name is Poppy. I love you. Those eyes are very human-like. Like a real girl, Poppy always wants to look her best. Perfect! Thank you! Her hair is sturdy and won't come out when you brush it. And smells just like a poppy flower. Is there anything else you'd like to say? But that's the thing. Poppy flowers don't have s smells. That is... That is unless, of course... It's an opium poppy flower. ...to see how all of the nation's favorite toys were created. Playtime Co. is now offering factory tours at just $2.99 a person. An entire hour in the most magical toy factory on Earth. What are you waiting for? Come visit the factory. We can... Hmm. <laughs> hmm? <laughs> We're still here. Find the flower. All right, hey, hello. Uh, uh, are you guys here? I got your message! Huh? What's this? A tape? Uh... Might as well put this up. Might, I might find a... Oh, there's one right there. Let's see what's on it! Hi, my name is Le Pierre, and I'm the head of innovation here at the Playtime... Oh, hey! Oh, hey! The founder! This, cool! And you're trespassing! Yeah, we played this little tape on loop. Well, you're not wrong. So, trespasser, just to make you aware, while we pride ourselves primarily on our high-quality toys and excellent child care, we also pride ourselves on our security. For example, this facility is full of hidden motion triggers, which, once set off, will turn on the factory's emergency alarms and directly contact the authorities. And that's one of the more tame aspects of our security system. No spoilers. So, wait, more tame? Wait, you mean you've got to have something more? That you're certain whatever you're doing Let's, is worth it. Uh, like, uh, actually, never mind. I don't think I want to know what the other stuff is like. But, I know it's trespassing, but I'm not. It's not like I'm here to steal anything. I'm just here to play my old co workers. Cause hey, they sent me that letter. Oh, need a code for that. Uh, some sort of color code. Anyway, get past here too. Oh, 
Well, I open the doors. Oh, hey. <laughs> Bunch of toys in all empty toy boxes. Hey, hey, is it color pad? Wait, gonna be still okay, so there. So it's green, pink, yellow, red. Let's try that green, pink, yellow, red. Green, pink, yellow, red. Green, pink. Green, pink, yellow, red. Uh huh. Yeah. I always knew I was smart. Smart. <laughs> my, I knew my fifth grade math teacher was, uh, was just being mean when she. We should keep calling me a stupid face. Well, who's the stupid face now, <laughs> Miss Buddington? Oh, hi, the grub pack. I remember that. <laughs> it was a very fun tool to use. Yeah, hold both cans. Fire, man. <laughs> Very useful for moving heavy objects. <laughs> objects handles. Worker. Well, oh yeah. Oh yeah. There, ha there have been a few lawsuits and involving that sort of thing. <laughs> good, good thing. Good thing they're a little. They've been settled though. That way we can kill. That way we can still use our grab packs. Okay, can we grab it now? Ah, yeah. Oh, it's only one hand right now. Open the bomber doors! Oh, hey, Huggy! Hey, Huggy, it's been a while. How are you? Good fun, man! Oh, there's my first trophy. Yeah, this will be this game will be easier to find a mug. Oh man, it's out of power. Huh? Hey, have you had that the entire time? <laughs> Thanks, man. I always I always I always knew I could count on you. You were always my best friend. <laughs> yeah. Alright. All right, we have power. Uh, Huggy, where'd you go, man? Where'd you go? Hmm. I'm sure he's here somewhere. He's probably just shy. He's always been the shy type. Huggy? Wait, oh, Huggy! Huggy! Wait, who's the... Wait. 
To help? <laughs> yeah, we've always had a lot of jokesters. Huggy? Ooh, this day feels nice. <laughs> Guess he's still shy. Ah! Knew there was something right here. Alright, let's see what's on this tape. Orphanage? Oh yeah, I remember stuff about the orphanage. Very, very good initiative that that, that, that they did. And Rich has always been a bit irritable. But he's a... But despite that, he's always been a bit of a real, real softy. Maybe irritable, but he's a big old softy. Uh, oh, Green was over there! Alrighty! <laughs> All righty, time to complete my grab pack. Yeah. There we go. Oh, hey, Snoop. <laughs> All righty. We oh, it's just the rollers. <laughs>
There we go! <laughs> Once again, I proved to be small. I proved myself to be small, uh, Miss Pepperbottom. <laughs> Fully, she can see me now. Ah! I've always hated those alarms. I never, I've never liked the loud noises. <laughs> He's power. Oh, yeah. So, man's got to go this way. Oh, hey. Right there. All right. What's on this one? So, Stella, what made you want to work at the Playtime Co. Factory? Playing with toys when I was young was so magical. I could go straight from my bedroom floor to anywhere in the world. It was such a great feeling. And being able to work at a toy factory, somewhere that can provide kids with that same experience, that's a pretty great feeling too. Sometimes though, I really, really wish I could go back. To being a kid, I mean. And it's weird, because Adults are just kids, but older. I don't think anyone ever really feels like an adult. But your body just gets older and older, and then you die. Poof! <laughs> Human bodies just can't stay young forever. There's things indeed, though, like some trees that can stay alive even while being but then, way uh, older. But then there was that. Uh, what was it? The bigger bison issue that somebody so. made. To I guess everyone is Prove otherwise? Uh, I can't remember the full details. I, I never, I never did get high enough, high enough security clearance to, to have access, uh, access to that knowledge. But eh, it is what it is. <laughs> yeah, I did it once again, Miss Pennybottom.
Oh wait. Oh, do I need you collect the pieces? No, it doesn't look like it. I see. <laughs> I had to pull these. <laughs> right, how could I forget? <laughs> Assembled. And then the quality assurance scanner to make sure it's in tub working condition. Made a friend. Okay, click and break a character. Oh, why? It's my first time doing this, so I gotta be ready. What are you doing? Why are you having smiling like that? Uh, no, Huggy! What's going on, you, buddy? Okay, okay, okay. Oh, okay. No! Don't do it, buddy! Okay, please, no, don't do this, buddy! I thought we were friends! Wait! Oh shit, no! Ah! No! Okay, don't do this! Ah! 
Wait, I know! Oh, oh, honey! What happened to you, man? You used to be so shy! Oh, Huggy! I thought we were friends! <laughs> huh? There's another tape. Oh. Hang on. That was my brother. The tape, uh, tape play over here. Okay, what's this? In relation, experiment one zero zero six, the prototype. Coordination and cooperation is evidently within his skill set, as well as the skill set of all other experiments of his type. Though still mm -hmm. missing, today's events are no doubt in relation to him. His absence was a flaw in the scientific process, which should have under no circumstances been left unaccounted for. Wait, that's why you say it was your six? So that the same the prototype I even uh, that's a, uh, I have, that's a name I haven't heard forever. Will need to be contained and disposed of in a secure location. That guy has always been really smart. I'm not worried about myself. He's definitely He's smarter than me. Back. We must forge onwards in the name of science. Those who are beneath us understand it or not. End of. Uh, that was weird, but okay. Huh? What's this? No, stop, go back, run. Danger, turn around. But this is the flower I was told to look for it. See, look, there's this flower shape around it. This is definitely what I'm supposed to find it. Huh? Why does this area look like it as if it's homey, like home-like? I never knew we had a room like this at the factory. Then again, I've never been this far deep into the factory before. Hey, it's a poppy doll. Let's play with her. Oh, 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 wait, no lights! Oh. And that is all for this episode. Make sure to like and subscribe if you like the video. And also... Uh, also turn on bell notification... Lost train of thought. Also turn on the bell notification so you never miss an upload. If you haven't done that already, make sure you do that. And also check out my other socials. Like my Twitch channel and my awesome Discord server. For, and with that... I'll see you guys in the next one. See you later.